Something that people should consider when choosing their main is simply just what do you prefer to, uh, to play as? Are you the type of person that wants to have things feed into your style, or are you the type of person that's going to adjust your game to what the trends are and the analytics and what everybody says that? And if you're the type of person that sticks to it, then stick to your principles. If you're a little bit more fluid, then always constantly be changing and looking at, at picking up new things. Do not be afraid of growing, of changing. You are not married to your main. You should really play who you want, and I mean that wholeheartedly. I mean, the reality is, you know, there is a meta, there is a competitive tier list, you know, tiers are real. But um, in past Smash games, things were a little more clear-cut. You know, there's only a handful of characters if you want to be a competitive player. In this game, you can really play who you want, and it's not really your fault until you lose. It's not your fault when you lose until you get to a higher level of play. So I think there's a representative for pretty much every character in the roster that plays at top level somewhere in the U.S., and that person has had some good runs at some point. So in this game, just play who you want. I will say uh, the ability to recover. A lot of people struggle getting back to stage and uh, getting less trapped. I will say that, yeah. I want to say if you're really playing to play competitive, play, play a top tier. Like, but if you're not going to be in that mindset, play who you like. So I, it's definitely like personal preference. Depends. It's also your mindset as well.